Right now I am performing the max long-term SPL testing for the Philharmonic BMR speaker. And I am at about, well, this measurement will be eight volts. That test passed the 3 dB of compression threshold and the uh, 20 dB relative to the fundamental distortion threshold. And uh, it's 20, 120 seconds between each test. So it says eight volts, it's actually finishing up the eight volt and it will go to the nine volt measurement next. And just a little bit about why I chose to do the setup this way was because I was concerned that with high output testing with a stand, it might be possible for the speaker to slightly rock back and forth. I mean, I doubt it. If, if anything, it's probably talking millimeters, but you know, it makes me feel more confident in the measurement. Uh, also, using the ground plane measurement increases my window for reflection. Even though I am using Clipple's in situ compensation module, I just like to get the reflection window uh, pushed up as high as possible. That way there's less chance of any anomalies or anything like that happening. And as you can also see, I am in line with the tweeter and I am at about one meter. So the measurement table results will show six dB higher output than what is actually there. And by that, I mean, let me go to the table results. So right now with the eight dB measurement, it's saying the max SPL is 100.78. So you would have to subtract six dB off of that since I'm doing a ground plane two pi measurement. And when you do that, the, uh, the two pi space contributes another six dB to the measurement. So I've not compensated my microphone to account for that six dB difference. I'm just gonna take that off the top when I post results. But anyway, it's coming up on the nine volt measurement now and I'll let it complete that just so you can hear it. And also to note, I'm doing four averages just to also help reduce the noise floor. So get ready, close your ears or turn the volume down. Looks like it passed that nine volt and it will continue on to a 10 volt step. So right now it's saying the, the SPL at nine volt was about 102 dB. So again, take 6 dB off of that. That's saying 96 dB. This is actually full range. You can see that I'm showing F min, F max to about 20 Hertz to 
20 K Hertz and the max compression right now is 2.89 DB. And I'm going to guess that in this next round of testing with 10 volt, I'm probably going to hit that threshold. I'm going to go ahead and turn this camera off now because there's no need for everybody to sit here and watch this. But anyway, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a, a really good realistic idea of how this measurement is being performed. So you have confidence and its accuracy and you also understand what the signal to the dot is. That's it. Thanks.